Assalamu alaikum students welcome to maths class today we will continue chapter 7 of your maths book that is cubes and cube roots in this video we will learn to find cube root through estimation so let's begin here we have a number 1331 it is a cube number clear so first of all we will start making groups of three digits starting from the right most digit of the number clear so on grouping we have got two groups in first group we have 331 and in second group we have 1 right from this first group we will get the one's digit of cube root of given number and from the second group we will get the tens digit of cube root of the given number clear so first of all we will see first group and in first group we will see the one's digit of first group here it is one it means that the one's digit of cube root of given number will be one right see we know that if a number having one at one's place its cube ends with one so we will take one here understood now in second group we can see we have one we know that one cube is equal to one right so in tens place also we will have one hence the cube root of given number that is 1331 is 11 right okay now let's take some more numbers here i have taken a number 4913 this number i have taken from question number 3 right so again we will start making groups first of all on grouping we have got two groups in first group we have 913 and in second group 4 right now again we will see the ones digit of first group why we have to see the ones digit because this first group will give us ones digit of cube root of given number and from the second group we will get the tens digit right So here we have three. So the ones digit of cube root will have seven, right? Why seven? We know that three cube is equal to twenty-seven. Cube number is twenty-seven. It ends in seven. So its cube root will end in three. I told you in my previous video also, in which I had explained properties of cube numbers. So we will follow that. and you should learn these cube numbers these are the cube numbers if you will learn these are only 10 see we have only 10 cube numbers from 1 to 1000 so you have to learn these cube numbers it will help you a lot right good now we will see the second group see here we have 4 we know that 1 cube is equal to 1 and 2 cube is equal to 8 so 1 cube is smaller than 4 and 2 cube is greater than 4 so we will take the smaller one right so here we have taken 1 right so what will be the cube root of 4913 yes that is 17 understood okay good now let's take one more number here we have 12167 again we will start making groups so on grouping we have got two groups this one is the first group and this one is the second group in first group we have 167 and in second group we have 12 right now again we will see the ones digit of 
this first group why because from this first group we will get the ones digit of cube root so here we have 7 so the ones digit of cube root will have 3 right and here we have 12 we know that 2 cube is 8 and 3 cube is 27 so 2 cube is smaller than 12 and 3 cube is greater than 12 so we will take the smaller one so the tens digit of cube root will have 2 right so what is the cube root of 12167 yes that is 23 understood okay let's take one more number again I have taken this number from question number 3 here we have 32,768. Again we will start making groups from the rightmost side. So we have got two groups again. See here in first group we have 768 and in second group we have 32. We will get the ones digit of cube root from this group. So we will see the ones place here here it is 8 so its cube root will have 2 why 2 see 8 cube is equal to 512 it ends with 2 so we will take 2 here right now in second group we have 32 we will get the tens digit from this group so we will see that 3 cube is 27 you can see here also right and 4 cube is 64 so we will take the smaller one we know that 3 cube is smaller than 32 and 4 cube is greater than 32 so we will take this smaller one we will get 3 right so the cube root of 32768 is yes that is 32 understood very good now see within short time you will be able to find out cube root of any given number with this method estimation method right